Got it. I think it's it. I think that's it. It's not a Trevally. Yes. Yes. We did it. Hey everybody, Mr. Cranky Pants here. Welcome to Fishing Planet. Uh, the, in this episode, we're going to talk about the Kajinori Hunt Bucktail mission. This mission is very difficult, or can be, um, thanks to people like Hawkeye and uh, KP Shimano. They were very helpful in figuring out how to catch these fish. Um, I am really only reiterating, reiterating what they've already said, but I will show you what I did and how it worked out. So let me show you where I caught these fish, first of all. Let's just hit this. We'll get in here and I'll show you exactly where I caught them and what I used. For a really good video that goes over more detail, go check out KP Shimano's YouTube video. It was super instrumental in getting this done. So let's show, let me show you where I'm at here. So this general area right here, now KP was up here doing this, and Hawkeye was down here in this area, but I caught all three of my fish right here in this spot. Let me zoom in real tight. So what you want to look for on your sonar map is this water line right here, and you want to fish in this general vicinity right here. All right, let me zoom in really close. I'll show you the detail. All right. So on this spot right here, which is closer to this rock mass right here, we got our unique giant trevally on a pink bucktail, one and three quarter ounce. Uh, the number six aught hook, if you're using metric, just from, it's just one of the six aught hook ones. Um, you're gonna have to use one of those because they're heavier and they cast further and you're gonna wanna be using your ocean rod because you're really not going to catch these on anything smaller than an ocean rod, at least not at level 61 where I was at. I was using, I tried the rod that was like uh, the strongest rod at that level and it just, it never would have done it. Uh, this Trevally, for example, fights like mad. There's just no way. So anyway, you're using the six out hook. Uh, this right here is the Japanese Amberjack. They're all right next to each other. I'm zoomed in very close right now, so. And if I zoom out and go over here, this was the spot for the greater unique Amberjack. And I got him on the gold with white and black. All right. I got, um, so the only one that I didn't get on the gold, white and black was the, was the Trevally. Anyway, that's where to do it. As for when you want to be at peak times, I believe I caught all of them during the day. All right, as for the action that you want to be using when you're doing this, here's the actual footage of me catching the, uh, the, the greater amberjack. So you just let it fall for about five seconds. Maybe give it like a half a crank or so, maybe a crank, and then just give it any action at this point where it's at right now, any action whatsoever, and you'll get a fish. You can twitch it, you can stop and go, you just need to have bubbles. If there's a fish there, if there's a unique there, he'll take it. If he's not there, he's not there. And that's all there is to it. You're going to catch a lot of fish that aren't the right fish. You're going to catch, you're going to get a lot of bites that don't hook up. But over time, you will eventually catch these three fish in this general area. Now it took me, literally it took me, what's today? I think it took me four days to catch all of them. I got the first one right away within the first 10 minutes, um, which ironically was KP Shimano's hardest one to catch. That was his last one. I think I caught a total of three unique uh, or Trevalia, three unique of those during this process. I caught one unique Japanese Amberjack and this one. So it might take you a couple of days. Um, maybe you'll get lucky, maybe not, but go in there with the mindset of hopefully you get lucky, but don't be surprised if it takes a while. Um, one thing I can recommend is making sure it's peak time. I think daytime is probably better. Get in there, you know, give yourself some time. Like don't jump right at the very peak, get on the incline going up to peak, fish through peak and a little bit of the downside and then switch to the next time and you will get there. 
It's just a matter of time. Got it. I think it's it. I think that's it. It's not a Trevelli. Yes. Yes. We did it. The Bucktail is done.